Good morning students this is a teacher Sadna and I also want to know your names do you want to tell me your names okay great so what's your name Rishi amazing your name Sunbi very pretty name you all have pretty names right okay so let's move ahead and just tell me can you see what's written over here just read it aloud okay so Rishi says learn with fun Right. Learn with fun. So we'll have a lot of fun today. Okay. Okay students. Let's move a bit. I'll play an audio clip. You have to listen to the audio clip and do as I do. So just do the steps as I do. Okay. Repeat it with me. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. Just sing, sing and dance with me. I like to move it, move it. So hope you all had lots of fun. Did you have fun? I can't hear. Okay. So Rishi had lots of fun. Right Rishi? Great. Now tell me who likes to play games here? Rishi, Surbi, we all like to play games. Right? Okay. So we'll play a game called Where is the Teddy? Okay. Now can you all see this teddy? Yes? Good. So, you can see the teddy and this box, right? Now, this teddy is here. Now, it is here. And now, it is here. Now, teddy is here. Now, the teddy is here. Now, the teddy is here, okay? So, this is how we place the teddies in different positions, right? So, what do we call the positions? In English, Grammar, we call it prepositions. Okay? Great. Now, let's enter the world of prepositions. Okay? So, are you excited? Yes? Good. Now, let's start the game. Where's the teddy? Okay. Now, I place this teddy here. So, this is on the top of this box. On the box. Okay? So, this is on. We use on when something is on the flat surface. See, this is the flat surface. Okay. And I place this teddy here. So, teddy is on the top of the box. Okay. Now, if I open this box and you can see there is an empty space. Okay. And I put this teddy here. So, it is in the box. Teddy is in the box. Okay. And when I place it on the top, then it is on the box. Are you okay with it? Did you get what I said? Great. Now you can see the teddy. The teddy is above the box. Okay. Now teddy is below the box. Can you see this? Can you see this? It is below the box. Great. Above the box and below the box. Amazing. Now I'll place the teddy somewhere else, okay? Now the teddy is in front of the box. It is in front of the box, right? Now the teddy is behind the box, at the back. That means it is behind the box, okay? The teddy is in front of the box. Now the teddy is behind, behind the box. Am I clear to you all? Great. If you have any doubts, you can ask me. Okay. Now, where is the teddy? Teddy is next to the box. It is next to the box on the right. And now, it is next to the box on the left. Next to the box on the right. Next to the box on the left. Okay. Great. So, let's repeat the positions once again. Okay. Teddy is on the box. Now, Teddy is in the box. Fine. Now, the Teddy is above the box. And now, the Teddy is below the box. Now, the Teddy is next to the box. On the right. 
The teddy is next to the box on the left. Now the teddy is in front of the box and now the teddy is behind the box. So hope you understood the prepositions and the position of this cute teddy. Now that you all have understood the prepositions in, on, above, below, right? So I give you a handout and I will group you into two, fine? So first group will be Rishi and Rana. Second group will be Surbi and Sia. Fine? Now what you have to do is, it's very simple. I'll give you a handout. There will be some pictures and questions based on the picture. And you have to just guess whether it's yes or no. Fine? So both the members have to decide whether it's true or false. Okay? So are you ready? Give me a thumbs up if you are ready. Okay, fine, great. Now group 1, this is your handout. Group 2, this is your handout. Now let's see the first picture. You have 15 seconds to solve the first picture. Okay, your time starts now. The first question is, the book is on the table. So group 1, is it yes or no? Okay, so Rishi and Rona, you both have the answers as yes and the answer is yes. Book is on the table, on the surface. Great. And what's the answer of group 2? Okay, Ria says no. And Sia says yes. So Ria, yes, it is correct. It is on the table. Okay, Ria, if you couldn't understand, let me explain you again. The book is on the table. See the picture again. The book is on the table means it is on the surface, on the flat surface. Hope it's clear to you now. Now let's move on to the second question. Okay. Now you have 30 seconds to see the picture and analyze what's the preposition. What's the correct preposition. Okay. So are you all done? Great. So the question is the bag is behind the chair. Is it true or false? So here the answer is false. How? The sentence says the bag is behind the chair. Behind means at the back of. In the picture the bag is in front of the chair not behind the chair. Behind means at the back of. Front means forward. Hope it is clear now. Okay. So both the teams did a very great job. So did you all have fun doing the exercise? Yes? Okay, great. Okay students, now you know how to use on, in and other prepositions. So you have an interesting task for homework. Okay? Are you excited? Yes? Okay, good. So the task is you go home today and just write three sentences based on what you observe in your home. And use these prepositions on, in and above. Okay? It will be interesting to observe the things in our home and just write the correct preposition. Isn't it? So all the best and we will discuss the task tomorrow in the class. Fine? Hope you all had fun learning prepositions. Okay, bye students. We will meet tomorrow.